Okay, the Secretary General this morning delivered the opening statement at the International Conference in Brussels in support of the Somali security institutions and the African Union mission in Somalia. He said that piracy is not a waterborne disease, but rather a symptom of anarchy and insecurity on the ground. Dealing with it, he said, requires an integrated strategy that addresses the fundamental issue of lawlessness in Somalia. He said we must ensure that AMISOM, that's the AU mission there, has what it needs to fulfill the mandate authorized by the African Union and the UN Security Council. At the same time, he reminded all member states of the critical funding shortage for the World Food Program's emergency program, which still requires $168 million through the end of 2009. The strategy for Somalia, he emphasized, is based on a new partnership among the United Nations, the African Union, the European Union, donors, and Somalis themselves. We have his speech upstairs. He also met today with the African Union Chairperson Jean Ping, European Commission President Jose Manuel Barroso, with whom he had a joint press, press takeout, and with Kenya's Foreign Minister, among others. Uh, just a little correction, it's the African Union Commission Chairperson. This evening, the Secretary General spoke to the press, welcoming the generous contributions made at the conference today, where more than $200 million were pledged. He said that he is both hopeful and realistic about Somalia's prospects, hopeful at the strong support and political will that has been shown, and realistic about the need for patience and con constant commitment. The Secretary General's week-long travel, which started in Trinidad and Tobago and continued through Switzerland, Malta and Belgium, has ended and he is scheduled to be back at UN headquarters tomorrow. <laughs>